G'day guys. This is my T60 interior kit. I've been wanting to build this now for a while. I might pull it out soon and start cracking onto it because it's a bloody cool tank. I got this the um, the early series one where they're running around in the tundra. Um, it's got the decal with the um, red star on it. And that's the one I chose. I got it ages ago when I was in store, when you're still allowed to go into store. And let's have a quick look. So, it's bloody unreal. You get all these parts, heaps of them. Heaps of photo etch, really cool decals. I love mini arts decals, number one, I reckon. See all these parts, something like close to 500 of them, they say. And it's full interior. I've just been looking through the instructions earlier. As you can see, start to build up the transmission and all that. It's got its full painting guide. They reckon you paint it in white, but I'm not sure. Then you can build the engine. It's nice. It's got heaps of photo etch parts on it. Oh, my, my kettle's ready. Um, I like that little fire extinguisher. And then you got all that that you put together and the batteries and everything and then the little rear wall here that goes in and then you paint it all up so there you put the other side wall on you put the radiators in everything like that there's the radiator and then you just paint it all up before you start putting the exterior together it looks you know it's like a, a good challenge of a kit this one that's why i've held it off because it is a bit of a challenge you know, such a small little tank with the interior parts. And you've got all those. You know, the, the turret, the turret's tiny. I'll show you the turret. And then all those parts. So the one I'm going to do is this one. See, with these real red star on this turret. I like that. Yeah, and I might even do a, um, a winter wash, but I'm not sure. Because... But I've used all these decals. They put in all these German decals. And I've used those on other tanks. It was really handy. Thanks, Mini Art. So they, they all included those decals and I just cut them out. And I've used them on my other tanks, like my conversions and all that kind of stuff. So that was really handy. This kit is good because it's got heaps of decals. Um, and you can see the tiny little tracks. That's going to be hard. I've got a plan for that. I'm going to use masking tape, so I've got them in little baggies because I've already opened it, I opened it when I got it, I was so excited. Look at the tiny little turret, look how small it is, compared to, you know, all the other ones. You could fit like one or two heads in that maybe at the max, but, but this kit's packed with detail. And yeah, look at the engine, that's the, it looks like the engine, or the transmission or something. Yeah, that's the engine because it's got the fan. And you've got all those exhaust parts and everything. It's just such a cool kit. Such a cool kit. I'll show you the photo etches. The photo etch parts that you get. Sorry, hold on. It's hard doing things with one hand. So you get that photo etch set. All those grills and stuff like that. And you get another one, I do believe. Uh, yeah, just another little one. They're this. See, I've already cut out the German part. There's one more. Uh, and just get a few more plates there. It's really good, isn't it? Um, but yeah, the whole kit is just jam-packed with detail. There's the, the, the bottom part the, with all the rivets. You see the, um, the fenders and all that. Bloody unreal, there's the mantlet. Really, really, really nice kit, guys. Highly recommend it. And I paid 58 Australian dollars, I think. I think it's on the side of the box. This is all Aussie dollars. So, whatever that converts to in, in your old country. 58.99 Aussie dollars. So that wasn't too bad. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Just have a quick look at these. Just see the kit, it's just packed full of stuff.
and it's just a tiny little tank. Well, thanks anyway, guys. I'm really looking forward to doing this one.